In this video, we'll walk through five of the most powerful features Stock Rover has to offer. Let's dive in and explore how these features can help you invest with confidence. Stock Rover is known for its powerful screeners, which can quickly find and rank stocks and ETFs. To access them, go to My Collections and select Screeners. Out of the box, Stock River provides a complete set of default screeners, each built around a different investment strategy. You can also input more than 150 additional screeners from the investor's library. We'll run the Safe Performers screener. We run a screener simply by clicking on it. A tooltip shows its filtering criteria. This is a ranked screener, meaning it returns up to the top 50 tickers that best match the criteria in ranked order. The results appear in the table, in a view, which is just a set of columns organized around a theme. Here we're showing results using the historical returns view. Stock Rover ships with a full set of pre-built views, and you can view the screener results in any of these views which are organized into folders. We can also switch to the special screener filters view, which displays screener filters as columns, creating a dynamic display that updates whenever a new screener is run. Here we see 21 tickers have passed our screeners filtering criteria. To modify a screener, simply right click. Here we see eight criteria. Let's increase the institutional ownership percent filter from 60 to 70. The preview pane now shows 16 passing tickers. The pane is designed to give you a sense of what passes the screener. You can also test tickers to see why they didn't pass the screener. Clicking Save and Run in Table refreshes the results and displays each filter as a column in the table. Let's create a new screener for ETFs. We'll add three criteria. We'll start with Morning Star Rating, greater than four stars. Next, we'll select the Return versus S&P 500 folder, and we're interested in a three-year return versus the S&P 500 greater than 5%. Lastly, we'll add expense ratio. We're looking for a value less than 0.20%. The preview pane shows 17 ETFs pass. We'll save this as a screener called My ETF Screener. Now we see the 17 tickers alongside the criteria they met. The table lets you compare stocks and ETFs across a wide range of financial, operational, and price performance metrics. Here, I've loaded a portfolio called Dividend Growth and Consistency using the Portfolio Performance view from the Portfolio folder. Views are simply collections of metrics where each column represents one metric. To learn more, click Explain on a column header. Stock Rover ships with more than 50 views organized into logical folders. There are many more available from the investor's library. Let's switch to the Dividend Growth Yield view from the Dividends folder. The table is highly customizable. 
Let's sort by payout ratio. Then filter for companies with a ratio above 70%. Let's clear the filter. Beyond sorting and filtering, the table offers additional customization, including row options, the ability to add columns, and more, so you can tailor it exactly to your research needs. This flexibility makes the table a powerful workspace for research and comparison. Stock Rover helps you keep tabs on your portfolios in a myriad of ways. First, you can link to your brokerage via Brokerage Connect for automatic portfolio updates. You can also create portfolios directly in Stock Rover. You can enter positions, transactions, or import holdings from a file. Understanding how your portfolios are performing on an absolute basis and relative to a benchmark is critical in making investment decisions and for prudent portfolio management. Analytics is an integral part of Stock Rover's investment platform. For example, for these selected portfolios, we'll pick a few of the analytics tabs. Here we see value over time over the last two years. as well as holdings detail, and monthly returns, both as a heat map and a bar chart. Here we see the portfolio's returns and returns versus the S&P 500, and yearly returns as well. Stock Rover offers powerful charting tools to help you visualize price trends and performance. Let's start by selecting what to chart. From my collections, I've selected World and chose the Dow 30. We're currently using the All Layout, which shows the table, chart, and insight panel together. To focus on the chart, switch to the chart layout. Here, we're charting Apple over the past two years. Under chart settings, you can toggle between dollar and percentage views, or use a logarithmic scale to smooth out large moves. You can also switch to candlestick or OHLC for more detailed price action, with tooltips available by hovering on the chart. We'll switch back to price dollar. You're not limited to a single ticker. Let's add Microsoft. And let's include the S&P 500 as a benchmark. You can even set the benchmark as a baseline to compare relative performance. To keep the chart clear, just remove any ticker or benchmark with a click. Now let's overlay earnings events. Hovering shows the detail right on the chart. For deeper analysis, you can apply technical indicators. Here we'll add MACD using the default settings to see how the signal line and the histogram interact with price action. Beyond technicals, you can also layer in fundamental metrics, such as price to earnings and price to sales. This makes it easy to see how a company's financial performance lines up with market action. Finally, the chart itself is highly configurable. Use the hamburger menu to configure each chart. You can also adjust the chart order. You can expand a chart. Let's restore all charts. You can hide sections. 
or delete the chart entirely, giving you full control over the display. The market moves fast, as does Stock Rover's research reports, which move with it. Get real-time snapshots of any of the 7,000 plus stocks deliverable as a PDF with up-to-the-minute analysis that static reports simply can't provide. Let's right-click and take a look at research reports for Apple. Notice how this eight-page report, which can also be downloaded as a PDF, delivers a wealth of information in a clear and organized format. We see quantitative scores, valuation and growth summary, profitability and return summary, earning surprises, seasonality, peers analysis, and dividend detail, and much more. I hope you found this video useful. I encourage you to explore Stock Rover and see all that it has to offer as well as check out our educational videos on our website. Thank you for watching.